Ladies and gentlemen, today I'm going to show you whether fires matter. So, um, what we're going to do is have a little matcheroo here, a little Play Doh. Stop smiling at me, Swan. Oh, sorry. Stop looking at me, Swan. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, first, I need to show you that both of these things do indeed have mass, uh, which means that they are matter. So, we're going to measure how much mass that is. So, we're zeroed out at just a hair past one gram, like 1.05 grams, or not even that specific on scale. So, uh, what I'm going to do here, I'm going to squish our little Play-Doh ball, and we're going to light the match. And the idea with the scale is that if something is heavy, then um, the little guy goes up here, and if something is lighter than what the measurement is, then it goes down. So, in theory, if fire has mass, so when I light this match and I put it on here, this side should get heavier and this needle should go up. So let's see if that happens. Ready? Hi, ah, fire in the classroom. <gasps> what? It's so taboo. What? Moms, you can't light a fire in the classroom. Yes, I can, because I'm a science teacher. <laughs> Do what I want. Okay, so let's put it at a little zero spot. I think I'm going to have a necessary close up here, people. Yep. And again, if fire has mass, this should go down. And is it? But what's happening? What? What? It's what? not moving. What? <laughs> so that means if it doesn't have mass, then it can't. So we don't burn the Play-Doh. Then it can't. 